guys, Goon Cake here, and I just got back from work, and I found that my oil trap hose came in, and I thought I would look up a video on how to actually install it, and I found out that there were no good videos on how to install an oil trap hose on the Saab 95, so here you guys go, I thought I'd give the world a good video. So, as you can see, this is an oil, the oil trap hose, and uh, as you can see from this, I had a temporary fix because mine broke on me when I did the valve cover gasket. Now, what I have to explain is this is a 2004 Saab 95. Alright, so as you can see, this is what a normal valve should look like. However, mine looks like that. It must have popped off or broke or something like that. That's all one piece. The original saw one came in, I guess, two pieces where it just broke. All right, so first thing you do is you need to get the old valve out of the line that connects to the throttle body right there. And as you can see, mine looks a little used. <laughs> and uh, this line right here is the line we're gonna be removing. And if you follow it, it goes all the way back in a confusing way, but it all goes back to this side, like right below my finger, under the air intake manifold, which is what this is sitting on top of the throttle body. And you'll find that uh, it's a lot easier to reach where it goes to around the other side, peek around it. Now I'm gonna detach it and show you what it looks like. One hour later, I finally got that infernal clip off. And anyone that has tried replacing one of these knows what I'm talking about. I can already tell. But if you look in between the mass air, uh, not the mass air, the air intake manifold, there will be a clip. Here, let me show you. There will be a clip right on that nub down there. There will be a, a clip on that. And it's this clip. And it's this clip right here. And you need to push the tabs in and pull it out. But mine was stuck on there for some reason. I'm hoping I didn't break the nub or anything. I kept pushing down and I had to like slowly pry it off it. I heard a little crack sound, a little tiny one. So I'm hoping that it isn't broken. But regardless, now I have to work on spidering this wire out. Well, as you can see, it is installed. Everything is all set back up. I was hoping I wouldn't have to do that. I was hoping it would just be the uh, left hose instead of the right, but. So, I also want to mention this for those that run a boost gauge. I have heard that uh, when you do the zero cost upgrade to route the boost directly to the air intake manifold, which should be like right down in there, uh, which you should perform first, check my last video or second last I should say and uh, you completely bypass this um, bypass valve <laughs> you make sure there's nothing connected to it that zero cost upgrade that's the one I'm talking about it's where you route this line all the way into hold on that top line when you run a boost gauge that's the line you want to connect it to so or so I've heard so we're gonna go test that out and see if it will actually work. So we seem to be idling fine, perhaps a little high, but it is a cold start. My, uh, my boost gauge seems to be reading vacuum pretty well right about now. Ignore the lame ass hair, but I'd like to give a shout out to Mike D for giving me the idea of poking through the air intake manifold to get the top piece of the clip pushed in while grabbing the bottom piece with my finger and then slightly priming it off. That was the best method that I could figure out. So if this helped you, leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. It runs good. I just took her for a ride to get a nice drink, a victory drink, and man, she's looking nice and clean right now. I was staring at my car in the picture and that's why it didn't look like I was looking at you that much. I have issues. But tomorrow I'm probably just gonna clean the interior. It's like every day I have to come down and give it attention just cause I love it that much.
But other than that, guys, leave a like, comment, subscribe, whatever. Let me know what you thought. It was a pretty tough job, but we got it done. Just a little tiny annoying job. But uh, subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys in the next video.